Hello everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to the channel, welcome to it if you're new. And welcome to Five Nights at Freddy's Reworked. A FNAF 1 inspired fan game that I guess aims to rework some of the, um... I don't know if it's necessarily issues, quote unquote, but... You know, rework certain aspects of the first game. And judging by this title screen, it seems to be very <laughs> intense in a way. So yeah, without much further ado, let's just jump right in. Help wanted, Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. For a uh, family pizzeria looking for night guard to work the night shift from 12 to 6 a.m. Keep an eye on the cameras, provide the safety of equipment and animatronic characters. The company is not responsible for injury slash dismemberment. $120 a week, okay. The Hurricane is hosting that. Okay, I didn't even realize that there was actual. Oh, wow. Bruh, okay. <laughs> I was not expecting that. I kind of figured it was going to be like most fan games where it's just like. You know, oh. Okay, where? Uh, hello? Hello? сообщение, чтобы помочь устроиться в твою первую ночь. Вообще-то я работал в этом офисе до тебя. Собственно говоря, сейчас заканчиваю свою последнюю неделю. Итак, зная, что это может быть немного неожиданно, но я здесь, чтобы сказать, что беспокоиться не о чем. И у тебя все получится. Итак, давай просто сосредоточимся на том, чтобы ты справил свою первую неделю, ладно? Давай посмотрим сначала и есть вступительно приветствие компании, которое я должен прочитать. Это формальность, ты же понимаешь. Добро пожаловать в пиццерию Фредди Фасбера. Это волшебное место как для детей, так и для взрослых, где фантазия и веселье воплощаются в жизнь. Фасбер Интертеймент не несет ответственности за ущерб имуществу или личности. При обнаружении причиненного ущерба или смерти заявление о пропаже человека будет подано в течение 90 дней. Или как только имущество и помещение будут тщательно вымыты и отделены. А как раз заменены. Оу, oh, хай! Бла-бла-бла. <laughs> I was not это expecting that. Плохо, я знаю, но на Just getting into the camps to see that. Okay, hello. Can I use a light by chance? I don't think so, but... That would actually be kind of cool to see him in like some form of light. Also, I just realized Bonnie has uh, eyebrows, which I never expected to see, but you know, it's fair enough. Oh yeah, it's handsome on there. Oh, it's Chica who doesn't have the eyebrows. I don't know. Hmm. How do I shut up the phone, man? Hmm. Luckily, we had the subtitles on up here, so... What's happening? Hmm. I gotta admit, this actually does not look half bad, honestly. <laughs> it really doesn't. Uh, ooh, you can actually see the seats in here. That's cool. Wait, I just realized, there's stuff behind us. Wait. Hold on. Wait, I can't even look behind me. Wait. How, what is up with this down here? Well, I guess we might figure that out eventually, huh? Hmm. That's a bit worrisome, but you know what? <laughs> Might not need to worry about that just yet. So, yeah. Also, the Freddy head on the floor kind of reminds me of Golden Freddy slightly. I don't know why. I guess because, like, so used to having his mouth open wide, so. I don't know why. <laughs> That's kind of my thing to remember him. Oh, yeah, eyeballs and teeth. Hmm. <laughs> oh, why are you laughing at it? Can I call 911? <laughs> or some kind of, uh, whatchamacallit, emergency services. I need some help. Oh, hi, Bonnie's on the move. Oh, uh, there he is. Huh, he didn't go far. So we have what I'm guessing is the entrance right up here where the little dot is <laughs> on the top right of the dining area. I don't know what this is. It looks like another room. 
Bro, I swear if Freddy's able to like go across the halls, <laughs> that would be creepy. Now we got stuff behind the office, which not a lot of fan games do that actually. So I'm kind of intrigued by that actually. I get. Whoa, wait. Oh yeah, we saw him here a second ago, didn't we? Oh, hi, wait. I just realized he had the different bows. I didn't notice that it. Whoa. Well, I, I never played this before, so I didn't know that. Hi, Chica. You're on the move, too. Huh. Okay, cool. <laughs> They're moving kind of quick, actually. I wonder if this game actually kind of relies on the same, like, random number generation thing for the animatronics movements. If so, that'd actually be kind of cool. To have uh, them move randomly. But not always guaranteed, you know? Alright, movement opportunity. What is it? Is that what it's called? A movement opportunity? <laughs> Where the animatronics can kind of move at like random intervals? As long as their AI is higher than the random number picked? I don't know, but <laughs> let's not get into the nitty gritty of it, I suppose. Alright, so I'm kind of curious actually on like how y'all act, honestly. I just realized something, this could potentially be like what the uh, 1985 location would have looked like. Not a guarantee, yeah, because it's an unofficial game, but then again, you know, this could potentially be what it was like. <laughs> there is quite a bit of uh, theories going around about... Um, what should we call it? The FNAF 1 location being like the old 1985 or whatever location. <laughs> Just being remade slightly. Or slightly altered to do whatever, you know? Wait. For a second, I thought that was the FNAF Plus Freddy down there on the poster. I was like, wait a minute, hold on. Hi. You know, while the phone guy was talking, that's kind of what I was thinking about. Like, if Foxy was going to be withered or unwithered. Good to know that he's going to be uh, withered. <laughs> Chica looks like she's seen some things. And she's just tired of life. It's like, I, I just want to go home. <laughs> I got a husband and kids. I was about to say a wife and kids, and if that's... Still the case, you know, good for you, Chica. <laughs> I'm not gonna judge you. Oh dear. I wonder why we can look up and down. I don't know. Huh. That might actually come in uh relevance later. I don't know. <laughs> oh hi Bonnie. There you are. God that actually looks very creepy, honestly. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I don't know what's creepier, the fact that these guys have all their stuff, or if the withered counterparts are a lot more creepy. Or, I, I probably should reword that, I don't know if these versions of the characters are more creepy than the withered counterparts, or vice versa. Cause like, both have their creepy elements, for sure. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> but I gotta admit, this is... Not that bad, you know, uh, visually and stuff. It's very interesting how it's set up, though, I gotta admit. Alright. Where is Chica? Oh, Chica's still there. Okay, cool. I, <laughs> I'm not gonna complain about that. But, wait a minute. Would Glitch Trap even be a thing in this, like, point of the timeline? And I guess it doesn't really matter because it's not, well, you know, <laughs> something by Scott or Steel Wool, but, huh. Same with Helpy. Then again, FNAF Plus did have Helpy in it, so I mean, not like actually in it, but. I think Ch uh, Chica's in the kitchen. Huh, okay. <laughs> I was not expecting her to go in there so soon. Or so. Oh, nah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't like that. Why did you sneak around my door like that? It's, uh, that's what I want to know. Get back here. Bonnie. <laughs> Get back here. I, I need to talk to you. Come on. Don't give me the side eye, though. <laughs> I like how he's giving me the side eye in the camera. Like, 
Come on. Oh, hi. How do you work? I guess like FNAF 1 Fox in a way, eh? Huh. I, I don't know, actually. That's the thing. I'm kind of taken off of, uh... I don't know. <laughs> Just kind of going at it in a interesting manner of like I'm guessing at this point. I'm playing the guessing game and a FNAF fan game. Bonnie! Bonnie! <laughs> Gonna attack? Oh. Uh, okay. I, I don't know what that was. Oh, hi. Let me shut the door. <laughs> God, I just bit everywhere. <laughs> I don't know why I shared that, but yeah. Alright, Foxy, how you doing? Oh! <laughs> I was opening the doors to see if Bonnie was still there, and it just hit 6 a.m. I thought I was dying for a second there. I straight up thought I was pretty much dead. <laughs> Thankfully not. Alright, hi, Freddy. Huh, I was not expecting to see different characters in the doorway. There. <laughs> That's cool, actually. Bruh. I like that. Alright, uh, Russian phone man, what do you got? <laughs> uh, he speaks a different language, but is somehow still visible in... Hello? Yep. Oh, wait. Yep. You know what, screw it, we're gonna mute the phone guy. <laughs> I know that's rude, but then again, I don't know what they're saying, and I really don't want to just be sitting here listening to somebody I cannot understand for the life of me here. Which is kind of ironic, because, in a way, our life is kind of on the line. <laughs> we have four, maybe five animatronics that are out to kill me. The reason I say maybe five is because I don't know if, like, there is somebody down here in these little rooms or whatever, but... <laughs> uh, that's the thing. Some of these games can, like, throw the biggest curveballs at you and it's like whoa <laughs> wow hold on oh yeah but yeah I, I don't know if they would though that's the thing it, it's possible that like a character like Springtrap or Golden Freddy might be in here I don't know you know then again that is kind of an interesting thought to have happen my lights keep flickering for some reason in game <laughs> For some reason, I keep thinking like, "Hey, maybe it's just letting us know that the animatronics on the move." Oh, oh. <laughs> I'm out watching Foxy. Foxy's not really doing much. <laughs> just gotta keep watching him. Also, something I like is the how small, not only the area with the bathrooms are, but like the bathrooms themselves. <laughs> uh, it kind of reminds me of like some of those like free roam FNAF fan games where like they have like one toilet you know <laughs> it's like I get it like if this place was just kind of limited on a budget and can't really afford much of a restroom area but like why do they look so small I mean I get actually I didn't want to rephrase I get like why it's kind of like this to kind of conserve on space and whatnot but like it looks so tiny <laughs> it's like one person can go in there at a time Oh, I would hate coming here for that reason. Not hate it, but I would not want to come here if I knew the bathrooms were just able to hold one person. Cause like, imagine you did. Eh, <laughs> I cannot speak. Imagine needing to go to the bathroom and there's just like a line of people outside. It's like, why is nobody going to the bathroom? Oh, somebody is in there, and there's only one bath, uh, one toilet or whatever. <laughs> it's like, why? I spent, like, at least a grand on each animatronic, and y'all couldn't afford to have a big bathroom. <laughs> uh, I need to move on from this conversation. I really do. Gotta admit, this is a nice little layout. Not gonna lie. <laughs> I like how Helpy is just waving at us. I mean... As much as he can, at least, you know? What is that? Put my stuff. 
Why am I moving? Like, I, I'm not even on the mouse. I would show y'all, but, like, <laughs> then again, I don't really have a camera. So. Why is Bonnie... Wait, Bonnie's the only one that's moving, though. Hold on. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about that. But you know what? Screw it, hey. Not bad. Also, I like how they have FNAF 3 inspired posters in here. That's pretty nice. Hi, Foxy. Oh, Chica's also on the move. Wait. It looks like they have like a mix mix of FNAF 1, 2, and 3 posters in a way. At least 1 and 3. <laughs> Sorry, like, I was kind of taken aback by seeing Chica right there. I was not expecting that. I really like how this stuff is, like, done, honestly. So cool. Ma -ma 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 <laughs> it's like that one episode of Spongebob where they're like, ma -ma 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 <laughs> Just stammering to get the words. Ma -ma 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 <laughs> oh, dear. I just realized Freddy actually has a shadow on the stage. Huh. I didn't notice that until now. Hi, Bonnie. Wow, I'm kind of surprised you came down here super quick. Not quick, but you know what I mean, like, down here so soon after starting your movement. Because I kind of expected him to, like, go back to the, uh, whatchamacallit, game area and stuff. Have yet to actually see him on the backstage, which is kind of interesting, but kind of nice. <laughs> I don't want him to trip on that. Uh, I don't know whose head that is, but it looks like Owen Freddy. Hi, Chica. You still look out of it. You really do. Looks so like, uh. <laughs> I understand. Why do you keep moving, Foxy? That's all I want to know. Why? <laughs> Get back in the cove, please, good sir. Chica's still there, Foxy's there. Oh, I was about to say, Bonnie's gone, hold on. Hmm. I wonder when Freddy's actually gonna start moving, actually. I'm a bit curious about that. Oh, hi. Wait, don't. I thought the lights turned off themselves. Okay, I guess not. Okay, uh, hi. <laughs> like how pretty she's staring at me now. It's like, I heard you talking about me. What do you need? Bruh. You know, something I find kind of interesting about Foxy is that he's already pretty much in the same shape that he would be in FNAF 2. Which, don't get me wrong, that's not like a big deal. But it just seems weird. Like, these guys, Bonnie, Chica, Freddy, you know, they I can see like how they ended up in this state. Right, being used for parts. But what about Foxy? Like, he's already in that state of like, oh yeah. <laughs> I know it's not like the biggest of ordeals, you know? But still, it feels strange to see, I guess. Oh god, I... I hate how I can't see anything while that happens. <laughs> Kinda concerns me that I'm about to die or something, I don't know. Why do I feel like that's gonna come to play later on? I mean, I don't know if it is or isn't or whatever, but... Oh. Oh, no. Um... Oh, God, we... Oh, hi! <laughs> I was about to say, we're about to die. Oh, that's an eerie thing. Okay. I like how the Chica head looks like the Wither Chica. Bro, I was not expecting that, honestly. <laughs> but you know what? I guess that's going to be where we end today's video. I was going to try and get through uh, Night 2, but you know what? I guess that's a good stopping point, though, nonetheless. Anywho, this has been your Captain Speaking. I hope you have enjoyed this first part of Finance of Freddy's Reworked. And uh, if you did, at least to some extent, then I hope to catch you all around in the next one. And until then, stay chaotic, but not too chaotic, of course, and bye-bye for now, I suppose.